Here we are. You are a textile manufacturer and you have just decided to launch a range of certified products. You now need to get prepared for the EcoCert auditor's visit and answer all his questions. But what exactly are they going to ask for? What are they going to check? What is going to happen during this audit? Don't panic. We are going to explain to you what the audit of your products is about. There are four main stages during the audit. The opening meeting. The auditor asks questions about your activity, your certification project, and presents the list of topics that will be addressed. The documentary audit phase. The auditor asks you to provide him with several documents related to your company's activity, such as conformity and transaction certificates of your suppliers, records to ensure products traceability. The process visit. The auditor observes the company's facilities with you by following the product flow, reception area, raw material storage, samples bank, processing, preparation, finished product storage, shipping area. The auditor also takes this opportunity to interview employees to verify, among other things, health and safety conditions, salary conditions, and so on, if applicable. Finally, the closing meeting. The auditor summarizes the audit findings, writes a report with non-conformities, if any, and explains the rest of the certification process. And what does the auditor check during the audit? The auditor makes sure that your system is reliable and that you comply with the requirements of the standard. To do this, he mainly checks the products to be certified, sales and communication documents, ingredients, accessories and possible auxiliaries, the traceability and flow management system, the control system, records and procedures in place, if applicable, environmental management, in particular the management of waste and discharges, if applicable, social requirements according to the required certification. Of course, the auditor does not check all products and documents. This would be far too long and unnecessary. He will proceed by sampling to obtain a representative sample of your activity. So what needs to be prepared before the audit? The audit is coming soon, and you want to make sure you haven't forgotten anything? Don't worry, approximately two weeks before the audit, you will receive a detailed notification of visit by email, listing the documents and information you will need, and the list of people involved, as well as an indicative plan of the audit.